Bobby's hubby, Nick Cannon, is getting major heat for his new white face alter ego. You gotta see this. Welcome back to Clever Music. This is a weird story that we have for you guys. Nick Cannon is apparently coming out with a new album. He debuted a new alter ego wearing a red hair wig, painted white face, fake teeth, beanie, and plaid shirt on his Instagram exclaiming, it's official, I'm white. Hashtag white people party music in stores April 1st. Hashtag good credit, hashtag beer pong, and more. So his new album is called White People Party Music, Clever. Following that photo, Nick posted a video revealing his new alter ego's name. Take a look. Connor Small, that's the name, bro. Connor's over the top brotastic attitude is solidified in part two of that video. Watch this clip. This guy's good, bro. He's going. He's like freestyle. Someone should sign this guy. Go strong when Martin Luther King. Said, let freedom ring. Oh, he's good. So clearly, Nick Cannon is making fun of skater boys and frat bros everywhere to promote his first album in 11 years. And we gotta admit, it's controversial and genius all at the same time. The album drops April 1st on April Fool's Day, so who knows if this is just a huge prank on us all or not. White People Party Music supposedly features Akon, Pitbull, Future, and more. The internet is going absolutely crazy over this white face spoof of blackface, calling Nick racist, and Nick is seemingly loving it. Remember, he's a comedian, you guys. Mr. Cannon tweeted, It's funny how people take themselves so seriously. People love drama. We feed off of it. Just relax and have fun. He has also retweeted tons of drama-filled tweets, including, I love how offended people are by at Nick Cannon putting on whiteface. It's a brilliant way to market his album, hashtag white people problems, hashtag kudos. Nick posted this picture of Robert Downey Jr. in blackface from the Tropic Thunder movie, captioning it, shout out to at Robert Downey Jr. This is one of my favorite characters of all time. Hilarious. There is a big difference between humor and hatred. Do you guys think so? We don't think Julianne Huff meant hatred when she dressed in blackface for Halloween last year, but the public still doesn't seem to be able to handle a joke. Rihanna can though. Check out Rihanna promoting her new tour with Eminem by using a Teen Mom 2 clip. Just click there. I'm Misty Kingma, your music lover here at Clever. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter at Clever Music so you don't miss any of this. <laughs>